At the end of the book, we have the Pachelbel Canon. Let's take a look at the essence of this canon so we have a way to build on a foundation, just as Pachelbel did. His foundation is called a ground base. He's got a bass line which flows like this. And on each of these tones, he builds a chord. Now you can say, oh, I've got a lot of notes to memorize there, but what is happening really? We're just going down a fourth, up a second. Down a fourth, up a second. Down a fourth. And then we're gonna finish four, five. Let's put some chords on it. One chord, five, six, three, four, one. Then four, five. But now if we did this, we could get away with it like this, but it's some big jumps, isn't it? jumping all around for the root position. So if we take inversions instead, we can find ways to play this that are closer together. I suggest pairing them. We have here, we go to an inversion here, then root position and an inversion, root position and an inversion, and then four, five, or as written at the opening, we're just coming down so we get a scale in the thumb. Notice what happened there is we had scale coming down in the top, which is very nice. Then as we go on, now we get thirds with that coming down. So improvise a melody using scale tones over your figured bass and see what you come up with. You can have your own variations on the Pachelbel Canon.